Rivers are systems for moving water downhill. The river system is divided into three main parts, the upper course, the middle course and the lower course. The start of the river is in the upper course. This is called the source of the river. The upper course is steep and a long way above sea level and the river has lots of energy for erosion. When rivers have spare energy, they can erode their river channel and also transport material along with them. There are distinctive landforms in the upper course, such as V-shaped valleys and waterfalls. In the middle course and the lower course, the gradient is not so steep and the river is closer to sea level. In the upper course, the channel is rough and narrow and friction slows the river down. But in the middle and lower course, the channel is wide and smooth and the water flows faster. One way the river system copes with the extra energy is to meander. The flow of water winds through the valley, eroding on the outside of the bend where the water flows fastest, and depositing on the inside where the river flow is slower. This makes its channel wider and it also erodes the valley sides, making the valley wider. The meanders slow the river flow down and if a large input of water comes into the system suddenly there may be too much water for the channel to process and floods occur. When they don't have enough energy to erode and transport, rivers drop material. This is called deposition. So as the water spreads out over the floodplain, it loses energy and deposits its load. The mouth of the river is where it meets the sea. 